certified most accurate. Now your TV5 first alert forecast. Good afternoon, I'm meteorologist Diane Phillips, who yesterday we had quite the weather day, so we're happy to see a change of pace for your Tuesday. You will find, though, that the breeze is still around. Thankfully, though, it's not kicking as fast as what it was yesterday. We had those wind gusts around 30 to 40 miles per hour. As we look ahead for the rest of the afternoon during the daylight hours, we're going to see that those wind gusts will still be around 15 to 20 miles per hour, and they're actually going to stay there after the sun sets, too. Still overnight, we're going to have some breezy conditions. It isn't until tomorrow morning that we do start to see things become a little bit more comfortable in the wind department. But we have already gone through a wind shift this morning. We woke up with northwest winds and now we're pulling out of that southwest wind direction. So that's going to help to kind of bring in at least a little more milder air compared to the cool air that we were pulling in yesterday. For today, though, though it's still a little bit cooler, we're happy to see some sun in the forecast. We're hanging out into these brighter colors here. Still a few clouds have been around and we'll have a setup on Wednesday to where we'll start with quite a bit of sunshine, but we'll still have some clouds that start to build in and thicken for us. And that's why we have that mostly cloudy icon yet holding on. But with more moisture filling in for the back half of the week, you're going to find that we have cloudier skies that are going to be coming in. So it's not maybe the brightest forecast, but at least considering we do have the clouds and some moisture, it's not going to be too problematic for holiday travel. It's just some slight rain chances for your Friday and Saturday as temperatures warm out of the upper 30s into the lower 40s. But then here we go with the mid 50s for Christmas Eve and Christmas Day. Dry on the 24th, the 25th, we do have a chance for some rainfall into the afternoon. You will find, though, that that is going to be liquid, not frozen. So for those who are dreaming of a white Christmas, well, we'll have to work on that in the forecast for you. But it doesn't look very high on the white Christmas part because just these temperatures are well above average. We should be seeing highs around 34 degrees, so we will easily exceed that here in the coming days. Thankfully, though, we have quiet weather after a busy Monday and still those rain chances, of course, stay updated here online, but also on the TV5 First Alert weather app. Stay with WNEM TV5 on air, on the go, and online for more news and weather updates.